after they started. Go ahead. Hey, go ahead. You got uh, we have, we have PSD won the 1600, and Kramer Jackson was the division 200 meter champion indoors. Tom, go ahead. You do it then. Go ahead, call him out. I, I thought you said you were. Neil okay, here we go. We've started the 3200 meter run. This is one of the most anticipated races on the track. You got Logan Pierce. He leads LA this spring with a um, with a season best 939.79. He also was your 1600 meter one, uh, winner today. Uh, Christian Johnson, who is a defending uh, cross country champion in his own right. Robert Hope, who was third earlier today. James Turner, that's Logan Pierce's teammate. Neil Fitzpatrick is the defending champion of this race. Uh, Dylan Oliver of Northwood. Kramer Jackson, who was third last year. Brian Stanley of Episcopal. Brett Oliver Olivier of Fountain Blue. Lionel Moreno of Sumner. And that is Neil Fitzpatrick taking him through in the early pace of 110. Andrew Gathman of Holy Cross. Taylor Bazo. Parkway, Hank Patrick, University Lab, Spencer Albright, his younger brother, uh, his older brother won the uh, 800 meters uh, this, this afternoon. Chase Tan of UMS Wright and Tyler Juniker of Germantown, Tennessee. It's gonna get spicy. That's Neil Fitzpatrick on the early lead, followed by. Logan Pierce and his teammate James Turner. That's the way they ran the. That's the way he ran the early race in the 1600, following the lead and then making his move. That's Brian Stamey from Episcopal. I don't think that's that's not Christian Johnson. I don't see Christian Correct. in there. Correct. Uh, four and Can y'all tell me if you have one. a final in team scoring for girls? Five, one, four. Oh, I'm That's uh, Dylan Olivier up there from Northwood with the great haircut. That's uh, Neil Fitzpatrick still leading the way. You've got the uh, duo from West Monroe. We're still trying to figure out that runner in four. And that is Dylan Olivier from Northwood with that lead group. Is that Fountain Blue? Brett Olivier's in fourth. Brett Olivier's in fourth. Fountain Blue. Okay, that's where we're going, Greg. That's Neil Fitzpatrick. Brett Olivier looks like he was trying to split the two West Monroe guys. They shut him back. And that is Dylan Olivier, Oliver. Oh, this is going to be tough. I got an Oliver and Olivier. Olivier's in third. Oliver's in fourth. And Neil Fitzpatrick doing the early pacing duties. Everybody else happy just to sit behind him. Here comes Brett Olivier on the outside. He comes up to join, maybe to take over the pacing duties. Or to settle in front of Logan Pierce. And 3.33, so they're still on that 71 second pace. That's Fast but doable. These guys can handle this pretty easily. You've got a nice chunk of, of runners up in the front. Neil, Brett, Logan, James, Turner. Dylan, Olivier, and behind him. We call him up. Tom, we have the results of the girls' 4 by 4 relay. A UMS Go White ran 4.16.77. For 6, Newman fifth for 14.67. Bourgeois was fourth at 4.14.45. Third, Hewitt Trustville, 4.14.39. Runner-up, St. Thomas Aquinas, 4.07.73. And the champion, Mount Carmel Academy, winning time for Mount Carmel, 4.06.17. Okay, these guys are reaching the halfway point in a very brisk pace, looking very strong. I think we might see a negative split even. They're going to come through at about 448. 
That's that top four. Then you have the next four, and that contains Christian Johnson from Episcopal and uh, Kramer Jackson from uh, St. Paul. So that's a strong group behind them. Uh, at this time, we would like uh, the coaches and the athletes um, on the boys teams from John Curtis and Edna Carr to please come down to the infield. The coaches and the athletes from the boys teams from John Curtis and Edna Carr to come on down to the infield for presentations. Back to the two mile. Neil Fitzpatrick is, uh, is still taking over as the pacing duties. Logan Pierce, teammate James Turner, and that is Dylan Oliver, or Brett, sorry, that is Brett Olivier from Fountain Blue. That, Neil Oliver is back a little bit, leading the second group. That's Brian Stamey from Episcopal. That is not Christian Johnson. Oh, He's not in the race. Okay. That's Brian Stamey. Thank you. Three laps to go. Neil, James, Logan, and Brett. Brett Olivier needs to commit here. That is, we've got a correction. That is Stamey. That is not Johnson for Episcopal. Hey, Doc. Doc, we're going to give out uh, girls' team. Uh, call one last time. I think they're down here. McDonald's 35. Don't say yet who won it. The UMS right uh, was the runner-up. And then McDonald's 35 call for both of those teams to come down. Then we'll, we'll call out some teams. UMS right. UMS right. Calling UMS right and McDonough 35. Girls, teams, and coaches. UMS right. Please report to the infield. It's become a three-man race with Neil Fitzpatrick still doing the pacing for the teammates from West Monroe. And it looks like Stamey of Episcopal has passed up Brett Olivier of Fountain Blue. Brett Stamey is trying to bridge the gap. He's got his work cut out for him, but he's, he's game. He's a game runner. He's driving after it. If they let it settle, he's going to be right in there. If they dawdle, it looks like Neil's going to let him come into the race if these West Monroe guys don't take over. Interesting team tactics going on over here. And Brett Stamey has almost climbed back into the back seat of this four-door convertible. No top necessary, no rain today. Here they come. At the bell, he's there. It's a four-man race. Neil, Logan, James, is Logan going to go again at 300 meters like he did in the 1600? Neil, Logan, James, Brett, Neil starting to pick it up. Here comes Logan. Jesuit West Monroe. Logan battling. Neil battles back. He ran 944 last year. James Logan has already run 939. It's an epic duel. They were second and third in the outdoor state last second year. Second and third in the outdoor state. Same order. 100 meters to go. Brett Stamming has passed up. Oh. West Monroe, Jesuit. He won it last year. Can he do it again? Logan's not going to give it to him. He earns this one for the fastest time run in Louisiana this year, 9.35.15. Neil Fitzpatrick and Logan Pierce in an epic duel. Go 9.35 apiece. 
Stamey goes under the old mark of 939 with a 938, and Turner turns in a beautiful 942. They're still coming in under 10 minutes. All right, John, we're ready to go to the team. Go. Go. Ladies and gentlemen, this time we're going to present the girls' team awards in a tie for 12th place with 16 points. McMain and St. Agnes of Tennessee with 16 points. Wow. And 11th, Hutchinson School, 18 points.